Hey y'all, welcome back to my channel. And if you are new here, my name is Audrey. And today I have for y'all another Rose Gal haul. So a huge thank you to Rose Gal for providing these clothes for me today. I love working with them. They have some of the cutest, most unique pieces that you can find in plus sizes. So if you haven't already, hit that subscribe button and that notification bell to let you know when I upload a new video. And let's go ahead and get started. take a look at the first piece I wanted to remind y'all that everything you need is going to be in the description box down below I provide my measurements the sizes I got the links there's a coupon code everything you need will be down below but if you have any other questions you can always leave it in the comments and I do my very best to respond to everybody so if you need anything else just let me know so the first piece in this haul is a little more casual piece but I thought it was really really cute I got this little color block button neck tops and for this one I went with the 2x as y'all can see and it is just really comfortable a little bit more on the thin side and you've got the gray into the black and then that mauvey burgundy more of a heathered color right here on the sleeve and then it mirrors it on the body too the thing that i loved about this one is the buttons because i love those little extra details to something and that neckline it is a pretty deep neckline but you've got two buttons here i just kept this one button and the rest were open and then they go all the way up the neckline on one side i think that is such a cute detail and it's just something a little different on a pretty basic top really love this one the 2x was a perfect fit because it's a little bit more on the loose side anyway so I didn't want to go up or anything I didn't want it to be too big love this one I will say the black stripe in the sleeve so it's gray and then black the black you could kind of feel where it was sewn in like it was just a little bit more snug at those seams but nothing uncomfortable it didn't dig into my arm or anything like that but you just could kind of feel it when you put it it on but again nothing bad really comfortable oh and this one is 95% polyester 5% spandex so you have that stretch in there too love this little top I wish it came in a bunch of different color combinations because I love color blocking anyway but really like that one I paired it with some black flare jeans but you could really put it with just about anything and now the next top in this haul is this little blue plaid number. Now I will say before we get into the details of this top, I thought it was going to feel more like the shirt that y'all just saw, that more of a typical t-shirt material, but this one is not. It's a little bit on the silky side, not shiny and noisy, you know, like some material could be, but this one is just a little bit more on the silky side, but I loved it once I put it on paired with some flare jeans. So for this one, I went with the 3X and it is 95% polyester, 5% polyurethane is the other material but this one I love the, the plaid the plaid in this one is so pretty it's just blue and navy light blue and purple and white I think it's so pretty you just pull it right over your head there are faux buttons right here you've got some pleating at the bust and you've got elastic at the wrist now I do show this one two different ways so I show it out with the same flare jeans I thought it was really cute out for just a casual day just out shopping walking around doing whatever because it flows really pretty almost like a peplum but not quite more like a Henley style you know how it's got the pleating here and then it just kind of flares out just a little bit that's how this one was but I know that a lot of us myself included I like to show off my waist <laughs> the smallest part of my waist and so I thought I would try it belted as well so I just put on a little brown skinny belt little tan skinny belt that I already had to see how it looked and I actually really like it both ways so if you do like to bring in your waist a little bit more you could always put on a skinny belt and pretty much make it a peplum if you want to but I loved it both ways but it's just neat to try different ways and I'm always telling y'all oh it'll look really good belted but then I don't show it that way so I'm trying to show y'all a little bit a little bit of different ways to style it if that helps anything so I really like it both ways but I think the belt just kind of 
kind of did it for me. I really, really did like it. But even though the, the material is a little bit on the silky side, it's very comfortable and it's not hot. It was pretty hot when I was filming this. That's why my hair is kind of all over the place. <laughs> but it's not hot, not sticky, not any of those things. Really love this one. I really enjoy having options with one piece, just trying it different ways. And now the next piece in this haul, y'all know it's getting close to the holidays when you start seeing the red and black plaid or the buffalo plaid, but here we go. So for this one, this is a two-piece set and it comes with a black tank top. I'll show you that in a second. But for this one, I went with the 2X and this one is 94% polyester, 6% spandex. So I really loved this one. I think it's really, really cute and very soft very soft material not not really a flannel type material but really soft almost like a ah, i can't even explain it it's just really like buttery soft like a t-shirt you've washed a whole bunch of times so you've got seams in the back to kind of bring it in just a little bit for a little bit more of a feminine touch then you've got that black banding here and then the zipper up the front and like i said it's a two-piece set and it comes with a really nice tank top very heavy duty like it feels almost like a shapewear tank top it is nice so this comes along with it now i show this one by itself the way that it is so the thing that i wished it was a little bit it came in a little bit more at the waist i thought from the pictures online which i've included in here i thought with that black banding that it was going to be a little bit more cinched in but it really wasn't. So I show it to you as it is, and then I also show it to you with the black Amazon belt because I just kind of wanted to see how it would look. I was a little bit thrown off with, but Amazon belt has like a gold brass buckle, and then the zipper on this one is silver. That kind of threw me off a little bit. <laughs> but I do have a plain black cinch belt somewhere. I just couldn't find it in the moment. But I really liked it both ways, but I think belting it just kind of gave it a little bit more of a flare. Just a little bit more of an edge to it, I think. So for this one, I think I, I prefer, again, I prefer it belted rather than not. But again, you got options with it. If it's a cool day and you just want to be casual but look really cute, just wear it as it is. So I'm just really happy with that piece. Love it belted. Love it on its own. Love it. <laughs> And now the next piece in this haul is another top. So this one is kind of a twofer sweater. It's got a tank top made into it. So it's only on the front of the sweater part, the back, the there's no tank top part. It's just the front. This is made in, as y'all can see right up here. So for this one, I went with the 2X. And I love, look at the two buttons on the side. They're huge. I love those little wooden buttons. I think those are adorable. And the fabric on this one is 95% polyester, 5% polyurethane. So I love the texture of this. As y'all can see, I show it in the try on part two. Love the texture. It's that dusty pink. You've got the oversized collar that kind of folds over right here. And then you've got the buttons. They do include an extra button. It's sewn into the tag on the inside in case you lose one. I have a whole collection of extra buttons that y'all would not believe because I keep all of them and I don't know why. I just keep them, but love that sweater. I will say it's a little thick. I was out filming. It's pretty, it's not terribly hot, but that sweater is warm. So if you live in a colder climate, that one will be perfect for you because I don't know if it's the texture of it or what, but it is a very warm sweater. Like I said before, Rose Gal is so good with those little details that just make something feel special. So I was really happy with this sweater. I think the fold over and then the big buttons perfect so i cannot wait till it gets just a little bit cooler out so i can wear it again and i paired it with some denim flare jeans that i already had and just some little black clog shoes that i already had but i really love that one and i wanted to tell you while i'm thinking about it i also got these earrings from rose gal and i'll link these down below too they're just little sun i guess sun suns yeah but they're just i think they're maybe three dollars i think but i love them they're so pretty and you just put them on no problems and now the next top in this haul i have a lot of tops in this haul but i only have two more pieces after this one and their dresses but this one i really really like this one i went with the 2x so you have 
the black with the white here, white collar, a little bit oversized collar. You've got the gold zipper front and the gold zipper on the pocket. They are real pockets too, right here. And on the sleeves, you've got the white banding here and then gold buttons. This one actually reminds me of a Michael Kors top that we used to have at my old job. So I really, really like this one. I love the zipper details. And the fabric on this one, I'll tell you, is a little bit almost like swimsuit material, just being honest, but not in a bad way. It was really comfortable, but it does have that feel of swimsuit material. So this one's 95% polyester, 5% polyurethane. But as y'all can see, you could probably tell from the texture of it what I'm talking about. But love this. The 2X is the perfect, perfect fit. And what I paired that one with, I tried it two different ways. So the first one, you're, we're probably at the trial part for that one now. I paired it with some black skinny ankle pants that I already had and some black flats. I thought that would be really cute for maybe a work meeting or just going out to eat one afternoon for lunch whatever the case may be. I think it looks really cute. I left it out with those black pants. I thought it was adorable. Really comfortable, like I said, regardless of the material, it's really, really comfortable. The second outfit, because I knew, I was like, well, this would look really cute with a pencil skirt, but like I said, I rarely show it to you the other way. So I wanted to today, and I thought it was really pretty too. So you could kind of step it up a little bit. I put on some black wedges that I already had, I think from Avenue, and a black pencil skirt from Illiqui that I have had forever. I got off Poshmark for $5. I will never let it go. <laughs> but I loved it tucked into that pencil skirt. I thought it was just really, really pretty. And you could dress that, and you literally could dress this top up or dress it down, do anything you want to with it. But I hope that y'all like seeing it two different ways because I really loved putting it together that way. And if that's something that y'all wanna see a little bit more of, maybe different styles for one piece or one look, let me know because I love coming up with new ways of styling stuff. And now on to the dresses. So this first dress I'm gonna tell you is absolutely beautiful. It is this black lace inset maxi dress. So you have long sleeves with the butt wood button closure or you could roll it up. It has the roll tab with the button at the sleeve here. Button front at the bust, beautiful. You've got the lace inset all along the back around to where your bra, bra would come across and all of this beautiful fabric. Now for this one, I went with the 2X and it is 100% cotton. So beautiful, beautiful fabric, but no stretch in the sleeves. We're gonna talk about that in just a second. So here is the trim on this dress. I show it in the trial on part two, but it is beautiful. So you have the lace in set up here and along the hem of this dress gorgeous. Uh, the only thing, y'all know, I've told y'all before, my right arm is about an inch bigger than my left arm. So the left arm in this sleeve is perfection. It, I could move it, move it all around, do whatever I want to. This one, it got that little wrinkle like right back here where I was really worried I was going to rip that sleeve because it's just just on that line of being too tight. And I include all of my measurements, including my arms, both of them, <laughs> in the description box down below. So if your arms, if your upper arms are the same size as my left one or smaller, you will be fine, you'll be good to go. If your upper arms are the size of my right one or larger, you need to go up to a 3X and I hope that that will resolve the problem. You never know because sometimes it seems like the, the body of it gets bigger, but the sleeves stay the same. So I, I don't want to make that promise, but you definitely want to take that into consideration because this dress is gorgeous. It's beautiful. It's cotton. It's steamed beautifully. The wrinkles just fell right out of it. The lace inset is so soft. It's not itchy at all very, very comfortable. I just wore nude undies underneath it. I did not have to layer anything with it. I love this dress so much. Unfortunately, this arm just kind of did it for me. So I could still get it on and get it off without any issues, but just keep that in mind. I just want y'all to know because upper arms can make or break an entire dress. So we all know that, but I just wanted to make that 
very clear that this arm it was a no-go for me but I love this dress if, if, if you can do it get it because it is a beauty and now on to the last piece in this haul and I think it's it's up there with my favorite because it's just so cute <laughs> it's just stinking cute I tell you so look at this little number right here so for this one I went with the 3x and I'm gonna get the fabric for you y'all have no idea how soft and stretchy this thing is so this one is 78% polyester 17% cotton and 5% polyurethane so I wish that y'all could feel the plaid part of this it is the softest little bit heavier weight stretchy material it's beautiful I love, <laughs> love this dress and then you've got this made on little vest as y'all can see it's made on here I do lift it up in the trial part so you can see and then you've got the matching tie right here I think this is adorable especially for fall could you see this in a pumpkin patch somewhere I know they're opening some around here they may already be so I might need to go take pictures sometime <laughs> if I'm not working but I love this dress I know it may not be for everybody but I think it's adorable I think it's just the cutest thing the only thing I would say about the fit of it I do wish I had gone with the 2x but I tried to follow the measurements but sometimes the material itself can change the entire fit of something I just think that I I wish it would have come in a little bit more at my waist and I did try belting it it just didn't go very well with the vest over the top so I think if you're close to my measurements and the arms in this one were really comfortable they had that elastic in them I think if I had gone with a 2X, it would have been a little bit more fitted where I wanted it to be because the skirt's very loose and flowy, so I'd have plenty of room in the hips and the booty. But I really love this dress. I wish y'all could feel it. It's so pretty and it's perfect for fall. If you're taking fall pictures, this would be the perfect dress for that. I think it's a, absolutely adorable. I love the little vest. I just love, <laughs> love it. I think it's so cute. So y'all, that is all I have for y'all today in this haul, and I hope that y'all like some of these pieces. I have brought y'all Rose Gal a few times, and everybody always seems to love them. I know I do. They have stuff you cannot find anywhere, just very unique and adorable pieces. They take cute to a whole nother level. <laughs> and I just love working with them. So again, a huge thank you to Rose Gal for providing these pieces for me today for this haul. But y'all, thank you so much for being here and spending your time with me. And until next time, y'all take care of yourselves and take care of each other. And I will see you soon.